Hi friends, in this session of application of derivatives, we study about the errors and approximations. Here, first I would like to explain errors and approximation. The calculation of small changes or errors in dependent variable corresponding of small changes or errors in the dependent variable is known as the problems related to the errors of approximations. This has great importance in the theory of errors in engineering physics, statistics and several other branches of the science. Let I explain how we get it. So first of all, uh, we start with let uh, y is equal to f of x be a function. a function and delta x be a small change change in x let delta y be the corresponding change be the corresponding change in y then limit delta x tends to 0 delta y over delta x is equal to dy over dx is equal to derivative of f of x. So when delta x tends to 0 we get here implies that delta y over delta x is equal to f dash x plus epsilon. Epsilon is a small change in derivative of f of x. So we get here so delta y is equal to f dash x into delta x plus epsilon into delta x because epsilon is very small and delta x is very small change in x so both are negligible so we uh, assume it is zero so we get finally delta y is equal to f dash x into delta x approximately approximate so or approximately we could say it so in this way we have got this now we could put uh, f dash x instead of f dash x i could put here finally we could write in this way delta y is equal to dy over dx into delta x approximately so in this way this formula is very useful in the calculation of small changes or errors in dependent variable corresponding to small changes or errors in the independent variable so in this way we could do is now I would like to explain you some, now I explain you some important terms. First is absolute error. The error delta x in the x is called the absolute error in x. Second thing is relative error. If delta x is an error in x, then delta x over x is called the relative error in x. Percentage error, if delta x is an error 
in x then delta x over x into 100 is called the percentage error in x now let us see one example of tutor track look at here uh, there is one example we have if y is equal to x power 4 minus 10 and if x changes from 2 to 1.99 what is the approximate change in y so in this sort of questions of error an approximation we have to follow this algorithm here step 1 choose the initial value of independent variable as x and the change value as x plus delta x so first step we do here now let x is equal to 2 because the initial value here is 2 so the initial value of independent variable as x so x is the independent variable and y is the dependent variable here we know already that and the change value as x plus delta x x plus delta x is equal to 1.99 so find delta x and assume dx is equal to delta x second step we have today so we have to find out the delta x because x plus delta x is equal to 1.99 therefore instead of x we put 2 here 2 plus delta x is equal to 1.99 implies that delta x is equal to 1.99 minus 2 therefore delta x is equal to 0 0.01 minus the greater number has as negative sign the minus sign so i had to put here minus sign so delta x and this delta x we have to assume is equal to dx so we could write it also dx this we have got here now uh, the step 3 we see find dy over dx from the given relation y is equal to f of x so the given relation look at here y is equal to x power 4 minus 10 we have to find out the dy over dx because y is equal to x power 4 minus 10 this is the given relation function we have uh, this is the given function we have so therefore dy over dx if we differentiate x power 4 we get here 4x cube and the differentiation of 10 which is a constant would be 0 so we have got 4x cube now step 4 find the value of dy over dx at x y uh, at the given point we have to find out the point is 2 here we have to x is equal to we have to put 2 therefore dy over dx x is equal to 2 is equal to 4 into 2 cube which is 4 into 8 which is 32 we have got here dy over dx x is equal to 2 now the step fifth find dy by using the relation dy is equal to dy over dx into dx so because dy is equal to dy over dx into dx through this relation we have to find it out so write down here we know that dy over dx is 32 we are putting here 32 and dx we have got here 
minus 0 0.01 so we write down here minus 0 0.01 We multiply this, so we get here minus 0 0.32 this is our dy because dy we have got here final dy we have to take as equal to d, d delta y to obtain approximate change in y. So the delta y would be like this approximately delta y is equal to minus 0 0.32 approximately approximately okay so this we have got so appropriate change in y so appropriate change in y is equal to minus 0 0.32 where x is equal to 2 where x is equal to 2 so we have y is equal to 2 power 4 minus 10 so you get here 2 power 4 is 16 minus 10 which is 6 so we have got here y is equal to 6 so change value of y so changed value of y is y plus delta y or we could write in this way y is equal to y we have 6 plus delta y we have minus 0 0.32 so y we are getting 6 minus 0 0.32 so y is equal to 5.68 so it will be the change value of y if we make the change if we change the value of x from 2 to 1.99 the change of y would be change value of y would be 5.68 so in this way we could solve the problems related to the errors and approximation thank you